Joining me now, Josh Gowling, uh, manager of uh, Hereford. Josh, what a performance from Hereford. How didn't you come away with something out of that game? I have no idea. Um, I think at, at, when we were 1-0 up, Jack's got our, what is it, four yards out. He's dropped two in the six-yard box just to finish it, and he just kicked over the bar, and then, at, like you say, two minutes later, they go down the event and score. But we've had opportunities first half and second half to kill the game off. So, really disappointing. Look, they have a good side. You know, they play good football. We pressed them in, in the first half. Second half, they went a bit more direct into their nine, and, and he's... He's probably the best we've come up against, to be honest. And, and you know, he links things up well. He wins his headers. He's big, strong, physical. So we struggle with that a little bit at times. But you go, you, you, you can see two goals like the way we did. You're very disappointed to come away with nothing. You you have a look at it. And you say, you know, taking taking that lead so early as well. It must have been, you know, it must have been the, the icing on the cake for, for you to get away uh, uh, so quickly. In that yeah, game. I think so. I think we pressed really well. I thought we had really good energy. I thought um, Marcus is coming today. Obviously, he hadn't trained with us. And the press is to sit down and look at him on the tactical board and show him what he wanted, what we wanted from him, for him to come on a performance like that. I thought he was absolutely outstanding. Um, to be fair, we put a shift in all over the place, but I said to the lads, it doesn't mean anything when you don't get three points. So um, look, we played well. Um, I think, well, look, we, we played Darlow the other day and we ended up losing two one, and we've lost off to two one today. And we, we've had, there's been so many positives out of the game, but I want to win games of football and they want to win games of football. So you know, that's where we're at at the moment. We're disappointed that we're losing against teams that that end of the table but we've got to keep fighting them and, and we'll get it right that's for sure you, you look at the, the overall winning goal and, and you know it's, it's come off uh, somewhere last week and any other day it could have gone anywhere it's else it's like an own goal isn't it I think Jordan's put it in hasn't he so but I mean the first one was the one for me we switched off from the corner they took a short one we've not switched on quick enough and then they've ended up scoring from the post but the second one yeah we vacated the edge of the box which we normally have two on the edge and then he's shot and he's just 50 p it isn't he and then it's ended up Jordan's ended up going in and he's just like that, that, that's the day today. Yeah. Uh, a, a sad point at the, towards the end of the game. Uh, Owen Penley um, having a, an altercation with, with some fans. Well, what was your take on that? Yeah, I suppose ours. He just had some racial comments towards him, noises. Um, so obviously, he kind of uh, lost his head a little bit. Look, I, I know the coaching staff here; they're really great people, and that's not a reflection on them at all. And look, you come to stadiums, and unfortunately, there's a couple of morons that you know ruin it for people. And you know that's not a reflection on Kings Lynn at all. Um, but yeah, the guys out there. He, he, look, Owen's a really calm lad, and you know he doesn't react to things. But he's trying to jump over the hoarding, isn't he? Um, in there, so you know something's not right. And football is a really weird place. They've got bad players, so you would think they would understand things, but unfortunately they don't. And you know the minority sometimes let it down for the majority. So, but look, look, we we don't take that as a reflection on them because they're good people here, and the manager's a good person, and the coach staff are good people, and they've got good players. So you know, we, but it's just unfortunate. You look ahead next game, and you, you'll be looking for. You had the response to the diet, and you, you need the players to lift themselves again for the, have the performance today. <laughs> yeah, I mean, what we said to the lads is, you know, we need to get back to playing well, but you need to play well and win games, um, and, and, and that's the thing. And it, it's good. Obviously, we went for a sticky period after the, the FA Cup run, where we've, we were dreadful, if we're going to be honest about it. And you know, people were disappointed in us, fans were disappointed in us, of course. But you know, we're getting bodies back now, and, and you can see when we get the bodies in what we look like and you know I'm really pleased for Ty to come on I think that's his seventh goal of the season um, great finish as well and, and, and that was off us pressing and working hard so but we need to get back to winning games of football and, that, and that's the key thing and it's just it's been two moments in two games so it's been two moments at Darlow two moments here where we've switched off and, and, and it's cost us and, and when you're playing against the teams at, at, at the top they'll punish you and, and unfortunately the last two games we've been punished Josh thank you very much cheers thank you